Hi, this is Ilma from Ilma Art Studio and this is the photograph for today. A nice uh, floral arrangement I took when there was a um, competition in Toronto for the floral arrangement. And hi, um, I'd like to share with you today my poem devotional entitled All That Matters. And this is extracted from Colossians 3.11, which says, In this new life, it doesn't matter if you are a Jew or Gentile, circumcised or uncircumcised, barbaric, uncivilized, slave or free. Christ is all that matters, and He lives in us all. And here is the poem that I wrote uh, on that verse. This is entitled, All That Matters. When you wake up each morning, do you get anxious or do you start praying? Do you focus on knowing your Lord? Do you give Him glory and bring Him Lord? When you become born again, you learn to give up what is vain. You develop a hunger for knowing Christ and start doing things that are right. In God's economy, everyone is equal. No one can boast, for we all err and fall. All that matters is that we seek Him and believe. That is the only way we can grow and be redeemed. In this new life, you see things differently. You learn Christ's way of humility. He teaches you to walk and love each other. He removes partiality and asks you to love one another. Prayer Lord, show me how to treat and respect everyone equally. Reflection What makes a believer's perspective different from worldly view? And that is the end of the poem devotional. And here is a witnessing part or the testimonial part of the devotional. I think God spoke to me today um, using that verse. Um, he wants when when he talks. I, I know the Bible was Bible was written many many thousand years ago, but it still is applicable to us today. When he talks about Jew or Gentile, he's talking about believers and unbelievers, um, because circumcised and uncircumcised. What has that got to do with that? Because um, in 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 the old in the old testament um they do circumcision as part of the religious um rituals um excuse me i'll just have to take the phone call and um, as i was saying it's important that um we all know that Everybody, everybody's treated equally by God. And we are all in all our different stages of our walk in Christ. Uh, some, some of us are in the stage of rebellion. Some of us are in the stage of already having intimacy with Him. But um, it doesn't matter where you are because God and Christ is always there for you. So I think that it's important that in... As soon as we believe, as soon as we become believers, we have to be able to receive that this is a new life and that we should look at life now just like how God wants us to look at life, the way He looks at life, the way um, He wants us to seek Him so that we will be able to, uh, that we are designed to become like Him and that we are not designed to is to follow what the world says you know when when we talk about world we talk about this world about the laws of this world that has to do with material greed power and all that stuff because these are all against um, what God wants us to be he wants us to stay pure in our hearts to love him to seek him to follow him so that is the end of the poem devotional and I'd like you to Check my website at ilmaarts.com. It's I-L-M-A-A-R-T-S.com. 
and so you can view some of my paintings and my photographs and some are just in the background. So thanks for watching and God bless.